All right, what's going on, everybody? There's Chad. We're out on the water. <laughs> we got our bona fide SS127, Chad's Old Town Sportsman 106 PDL. And we're going to get on the water so you can go get them. Like, yeah. dude, that's warm. Yeah. <laughs> Let's do it. Blast off. Show you guys how I deploy this thing. Basically, I got this pull handle. It's attached to the shaft of the motor all plugged in and everything which it is got a little pulley down here pull on this it's connected to a clip that's attached to the pull handle if you can see it for the, the foot pedal system use my net to give her a little shove and don't drop the net in the water preferably Catches, and there we go. First official video from my bona fide SS 127 um, new kayak. I got it about a month ago, and uh, I got it primarily because it's easier to mount this uh, Motor Guide XI3 GPS on there and i absolutely love this motor it's uh it's a lot this this kayak's a little more efficient with this motor it's it's faster it's uh quieter it turns really well you don't have a rudder so um you're, you're missing the, the the rudder and the the pedal drive which you know i gave that up because this motor is just absolutely money and i love it got that spot lock gps and uh a lot of really cool features that I added to this kayak too, which we'll uh, go over later. But water temps, we are looking at already upper 60s, so that tells me it's going to be nice. Today's plan is to get on a frog bite. Last time I was here, I uh, caught one frogfish and had seven blow ups on the frog, which uh, was uh awesome but you know one for seven is not what we were looking for so let's see what we can do starting off we got this guy right here this is the river to sea spitting wah this is my favorite frog to throw at the moment it's a little coiled up but uh yeah, that's what we're working with right here. So it was, uh, the, the hookup ratio was pretty poor. So what I do is I put this like garlicky crawfish scent on here mm -hmm. so that if they blow up on it, they'll smell it and they'll be like, ooh, hell yeah, Cajun, Cajun crawfish. I'll put a little bit of that on there, fish sticks. Cloud cover is nice. Yep. Yeah, that's this is like right now, slight breeze, clouds. This should be prime condition for bites.
Dang it, I had one on again. I didn't realize it was on, dude. It grabbed it immediately and swam. I must have dropped it right on its head and it grabbed it as it fell. Because I casted it over here yeah. and I was reeling in my line and I was like, I don't feel anything. It feels like my bait came off. And I started to feel pressure and my line was all the way out here. And I was like, what the, f and it kept moving. And as I started to realize, I was like, is it a fish? I felt a dink and it spit it out. He's like, wait a second, this isn't real. <laughs> what I am noticing though, is they're up really shallow. Last time we were here, we were in five to seven feet and we were casting up towards the bank and that's where we were getting them. So let's try throwing the frog up real shallow. On the frog. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Look at that, dude. This video. That's what I'm talking about. Look at that. Just inhaled the frog. Ow. <laughs> Heck yeah. That right there, oh. this is what I'm talking about. Yeah. Munch the frog. Yep. Thanks, buddy. Got him. On the frog, baby. Look at that. Yeah, let's go. Oh, he's fired up. Thanks, buddy. Nice one. On the frog once again. Let's go. Oh, it's a good one. <laughs> yeah. Shit. Yeah. Not a good one. Got him. Man, they are inhaling the frog today. Yeah. I I threw it right in this pocket. Yep. Like a three pounder, maybe two and a half. Good one. Feisty. Oh yeah, comes up, blows up on it again. Yeah, he came up super slow and like nonchalant and just goop and I saw him swim down and I was like, uh-oh. <laughs>
<laughs> Say goodbye to your face. Oh, I got one. <laughs> no way. <laughs> I didn't think I had one. I thought I snagged. <laughs> no way. <laughs> I, I legitimately thought I just pulled up grass. Yeah. And I swung and I was like, why is it not fighting? Eh, it's got to be grass. And then I felt some pulling and I was like, is that the crankbait moving or is that is that a fish? And then I saw it swimming and I was like, oh shit. <laughs> Oi. Thanks, buddy. Let's go. Thank you, sir. Definitely felt like a bite. What's happening? It's gotta be dragging on the ground. Chad, they're loaded on this spot over here. Only 16 and a half. A quarter, I mean. Too small. Yeah. Another 16 and a quarter. That's my fourth one today. <laughs> Ooh. Gangster. Blue color jig. Might as well. This one's not getting munched anymore.
up. There we go. Oh, it's a good one. Yes. Let's go. Dang, dude. That's gonna call us something. Yeah, you're good. Um, yeah, dude, there's fry everywhere, so that means mama's nearby. Looking for some, looking for some bilfs, <laughs> some bass I'd like to, to finesse with this jig. <laughs> there we go. Ooh, yep. I saw it swimming. Stay down. Ooh, ooh, it's a big one. Shoo! <laughs> oh yeah! Choke the jig, son. He choked it. Oh, he's bleeding. Fuck. He really, he actually choked it though. So I'm way okay. Let's try this color. It's got some purple in it. Seem to work on the other ones. So let's try it on this guy. Let's just barely put the tips. Three, four, five, six, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Six. Have to soak for a certain amount of time here. Three to five seconds, air dry for 10 to 15. Wow. Super quick. There we go. Easy peasy, now we got chartreuse tips. Oh, that's butter. <laughs> Love it. How about diving with a whale shark? How about no? Okay, Scott. <laughs> what? I said, how about no? Oh, yeah. Okay, Scott. <laughs> How about no, you crazy Dutch bastard? <laughs> yeah. One million dollars. <laughs> yeah. There we go. He's swimming with me. Stay down. Stay down. Stay down. Don't jump. Boat flip. Got him. Why do you guys keep swallowing this thing, man? Let's get that hook out.
to get. That's not gonna call. Yeah. Yeehoo! <laughs> There it is. Bottom lipped him. Interesting. Ah, oh, there's my trailer. There's number 10 on the day. guys that's gonna conclude today's video today was a really good day I caught 10 fish I would have to say it was a very spring like day everything was all prime spring baits we got them on the frog in the morning we got them on the square bill in the afternoon late afternoon now it's going on four we we're getting them on the jig so it, overall it was a great day we got on them today we're gonna be back out here tomorrow if you guys made it this far, thanks so much for watching. Hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, and we will see you in the next one.